Good evening, I'm Sabrina Bergen, principal of Batuxan High School, and I want to welcome you to Back to School Night. I'm delighted that you are here tonight to learn more about your student's school day. At Patuxent, it is our mission to work together with parents as we strive for our students to exceed their potential and be college and career ready. It will take hard work and determination on everyone's part to accomplish this mission, but I feel certain that with our staff, students, and community working together, we can do it. At Patuxent, we have created a school culture of grit, high expectations, and achievement. We strongly believe in the value of grit. Angela Duckworth defines grit as perseverance and passion for long-term goals. Perseverance and passion for long-term goals. Grit is the quest for excellence in all that you do. Grit is your ability to endure to ensure that you reach your long-term goals. Grit is fueled by our courage to do whatever it takes to be successful. The Tuxin students with grit experience success inside and outside of the classroom. Having grit means never giving up on your goals. To accomplish this, we provide a great deal of support to students to enable them to succeed, including lunch tutoring, after school tutoring, and Saturday school. Many students don't realize what they are capable of until they try. When you have a student that is attempting a challenging course, do not be alarmed if the grade may be a little lower than what you're used to. College admission officers prefer students that challenge themselves. Encourage your student to push themselves and be patient with them as they make the necessary adjustments. The grit required will benefit the students in the rest of their courses for the rest of their lives. I want to introduce you to our school counselors and administrative team. First, our school counselors, Ms. Adams. Ms. Adams works with students whose last name begin with A through E. Mr. Deal. Mr. Deal works with students whose last names begin with F through J. Ms. Ryan. Ms. Ryan works with students whose last names begin with K through RI. Ms. Mahar. She works with students whose last names begin with RO through Z. The counselors will be in the front lobby to answer guidance related questions throughout the evening and register students for the PSAT. For our administrative team, we have Mr. Gladfelter, the 10th grade administrator, Ms. Rickwood, the 11th grade administrator, and Mr. Forrest, the 9th and 12th grade administrator. Mr. Powell is our full-time activities director. We are blessed to have an amazing staff at Patuxent High School. Our teachers are the most dedicated and student-oriented educators you will find anywhere. They truly care about your child's success inside and outside of the classroom. I have a few additional items of information to pass along. First, you should have received a schedule from your student that will guide you throughout the class visitations. One, now. If your student's schedule has the Career Technology Academy listed or a teacher is not present tonight, you may visit the various tables in the front of the building during that time to receive information about school-related clubs and organizations. Also, please support our PTO. They are a tremendous help with our efforts here at the school. There are several means of communication that we will use throughout the school year. The PH newsletter will be sent out via school messenger and posted on the PHS website. You can also follow us on Twitter at Patuxent HS CCPS. I also wanted to highlight that the CCPS website will have bus information for buses that are 10 minutes later or more. Be sure to follow your students' grades on HACK. If you do not have HACK information, please contact Ms. Hempstead in guidance. We have a PSAT table in the front lobby. We encourage all students to take the exam. I also wanted to highlight that this year we have a new PHS cellular phone policy. Last year on our Patuxent student survey, 63% of students said that the cell phones are a distraction at Patuxent. Cell phones may still be used in classrooms for instructional purposes with permission of the teacher. However, if a student is using their phone when the red cell phone sign is up, we will follow the procedures in the policy, which may include parent pickup. I would also like to ask for your help with social media. It's important that all parents monitor student use of social media to help ensure safe and orderly school environment. There are even apps that can help you with this. Finally, I'd like to encourage every student to get involved. Whether it be a club or sports team, studies show that students that are involved in high school are more successful overall. Thank you for attending this evening. I know I can count on your support this year in advancing the culture of grit here at Patuxent. We look forward to working with you to making this a productive and successful school year. Thank you and enjoy the rest of the evening.
Welcome to Patuxent High School. I'm, I'm Keith Powell, the Activities Director. If you have any questions about any of our activities, um, please get in contact with me. We offer, we're start forming a booster club. We have sports passes. And if you have questions about schedules or tryout dates, just, just get in touch with me. Good evening, Patuxent High School parents, teachers, and students. I'm Lucretia Eastap, the new PTO president for the wonderful Patuxent High School this year. Uh, this year, we're transitioning into PTO uh, from a PTSA, and the reason why we're transitioning to PTO so we can keep our funds in our school. Our PTO dues this year, the fees are $7 for adults, $5 for students, Family of four, $20. So if you would like to put in an application for membership fees or dues and be a volunteer, you can come visit our table at parent night and fill out any forms that needs to be filled out for membership fees, being a volunteer, and we do need volunteers. Uh, we do have some positions open as well. So if you would like to come by our table uh, and fill out forms and be a part of our team, that would be great. Our PTO works together with the principal, teachers, superintendent to work and do all things that are for the students in the community to make the best decision for our future leaders of our school. We do scholarships for our graduating seniors. You must be a member uh, prior with the PTSA and PTO for four years to be able to qualify to put in an application as a senior. If you have any questions uh, concerning the PTO, how to sign up, how to become a volunteer, you can contact our teacher representative, which is Tammy Jett. Uh, her email is on the website. If you go to Patuxent High School website, her email is there and you can contact her that way. And also you can contact myself and my email is on the school website and I'm Lucretia Eastep and we'll answer any questions or any concerns that you have. Uh, thank everyone, and let's have a good school year. Yay, Patuxent High School!